Fibromyalgia is a lonely disease. For me, people would say, you look so good. And because you look good, nobody knows that you're riddled with pain and that it just absorbs you in every which way possible. It also feels like it's no way out because you might be out with a friend or out with a person and you're just not yourself. I took up yoga because I was a dead woman walking. I had been in so much pain, I didn't know an alternative or a way out. For me, there have been two aspects of yoga that are important. One is the physical and one is the spiritual. As far as the physical is concerned, when I first started yoga, I couldn't even get out of bed. The thought of walking was my aspiration and my dream. I would look at people as we drove in the car walking down the street and think, oh, I wish that I was like that and so free in movement. And um, little by little, through the breath work and through the movements and through um, letting go of some of that physical pain, I dreamed of the day that I'd be able to walk on the beach. And little by little, I was able to walk around in the condo. Then I was able to walk around down the street or up the stairs. And the day that I walked on the beach was the ultimate. I could feel the breeze in my hair. I could feel freedom. I could see the seagulls and smell the salt water. Maybe to some that wouldn't feel like a lot, but to me, it meant the world. The second thing was spirituality and the feeling of connectedness. I think that when you're in pain, Sometimes you feel like it's background music and you can't hear anything else but that and you feel disconnected with the world. You feel disconnected with your higher power. So to be able to breathe and to feel like, oh my goodness, I'm starting to feel like myself again. Then I'm able to love, I'm able to feel connected and it's just a magnificent feeling. The other thing about fibromyalgia that a lot of people don't know, unless you experience it yourself, is, is that you get a lot of sleep deprivation. And with sleep deprivation, you can't think very well. And with yoga, by getting that breath in you, you're able to sleep a lot deeper. And oh gosh, that means the world to those people who know what I'm talking about.